It's not too late as long as you're in that line at right. 7 o'clock. You can still make your voice heard. Let's continue our team coverage. News 5's Katie Blaze. She's in Pueblo tracking some big races there. Yeah, big on tonight's battle, including one that could keep the lights on at schools across the area. And bring us the latest there, Katie. Well, that's right. Ballot issue 4A is one of those hot topics tonight, asking voters if taxes should be increased to repair, improve, or construct school facilities in District 60. Now, besides that measure, ballot 1A is asking voters to add a sales tax to pay for a new county jail. Ballot issue 1B asking to increase the tax on marijuana sales. And finally, ballot issue 6B asking voters to extend a mill levy to fund the county's libraries. You really are voting your pocketbook in this election that, you know, there's a lot of tax questions and how much taxes you're going to pay are on that on the, that ballot. So it's important to get your voice out for that. As far as voter turnout, Ortiz tells me things started off really slow, but have picked up in the last three days. Now they're seeing thousands of ballots coming in every hour. And our last check with Ortiz, he told us about 37,000 ballots had been dropped off. If you haven't dropped yours off yet, make sure you stop by the polls or one of these drop off locations right here by 7 o'clock tonight. And of course, stay with News 5 both here and online at KOAA.com for the latest election coverage and results. Always watching for you, Pueblo County, Katie Blaze, News 5.